Okay, check for cameras. No cameras. Here's the coordinates. All right, so we're here checking out bear baits as part of our investigation into the prevalence of bear baiting in this particular part of the National Forest because it has been designated wolf caution area because wolves have killed bear hunting dogs here. And what bear hunters will do is they'll set these baits to attract the bears and then they'll come and release their hounds from here to follow the bears through the forest where there's known wolf packs in the area and they kill them. So what we're doing is, is we're measuring uh, every bear bait we see, documenting what kind of baits are being used. You know, commonly it's foodstuffs. This particular pile of logs is saturated with oil, which makes me think it's some type of fryer grease or something. It looks like there's... That's like a puddle in there even. Yeah, it looks like pasta maybe, or I see some color from candy or something. So we're I just... I think that's old flagging. Oh, okay. Because there's some there, over there. So we're just going to measure the diameter of these sites to determine how much land is being disturbed is 15 feet. And we're not going to disturb the bait itself or touch it in any way. We're just uh, operating on public lands. And that's why we're concerned about this because this is a practice that's going on on public lands. And we want people to know about it so that they can voice their opposition to the U.S. Forest Service. And we could try to get this practice stopped here in northern Wisconsin in the Schwamagon-Nicolette National Forest.